I was born in a hospital in Brooklyn, New York, yanked out of my mother's womb by forceps. My mother remembers nothing. She was so drugged on ether, she wasn't allowed to hold me for 24 hours. My daughter was delivered at home by Tish, the midwife. The counterculture embraced home births, a familiar practice in northern New Mexico with a long tradition of midwifery. I was six months pregnant when Mark and I moved into a one-bedroom apartment near the Taos Plaza, my first home in New Mexico with running water and electricity. I had no desire to wash diapers in water heated on a wood cook stove. I missed my family who lived across the continent in New York City. When my due date got close, I tried to ignore a lifelong fear that Grandma would die when I had a baby. On our last visit, early in my pregnancy, Grandma told me that her childhood name in Austria was Minka. What a beautiful name, I thought. But according to Jewish tradition, I was forbidden to use it while she was alive. My water broke two weeks early. Mark snored peacefully in our iron bed, but contractions, not sleep, began to take over my body. Tish, the midwife, had to kick him out of bed. She was busy preparing for the baby when Mark pointed to a whiteness between my splayed legs. What's that? Oh, my God, it's the baby's head. Push, Iris. Why is everyone so quiet? Why are they not admiring the baby? Finally, I saw my daughter, but didn't understand everyone's look of concern. The baby was born but first. No head, arms, or legs appeared until she popped open to reveal a perfect baby girl. Birth weight, three pounds, twelve ounces. Her skin hung like she was an unstuffed sausage. I held Minka, feeling my heart chakra burst open. The umbilical cord had not yet been cut. Tish was waiting to deliver the placenta. Grandma died five days before Minka was born. The night I gave birth, Grandma appeared in a lucid dream. She handed the baby to me wrapped in swaddling clothes and told me how to care for her. That was the last time I saw my grandmother. Minka, my daughter, my firstborn. Possibly my grandmother returned. Mm -hmm.